Terrace of the Elephants The Terrace of the Elephants is a part of the walled city of Angkor Thom, a ruined temple complex in Cambodia. The terrace was used by the Angkor's king Jayavarman VII as a platform from which to view his victorious returning army. It was attached to the palace of the Femina Khas, of which only a few ruins remain. Most of the original structure was made of organic material and has long since disappeared. Most of what remains are the foundation platforms of the complex. The terrace is named for the carvings of elephants on its eastern face. The 350 meter long terrace of the elephants was used as a giant reviewing stand for public ceremonies and served as a base for the king's grand audience hall. It has five outworks extending towards the central square, three in the center and one at each end. The middle section of the retaining wall is decorated with life-size Garuda and lions. Towards either end are two parts of the famous parade of elephants coming from the Khmer Mahut. The Terrace of the Elephants is a striking 350 meter long and 2.5 meter high ornamental wall, which as the name suggests, is mostly decorated with carved elephants. It was built in the late 12th century as a viewing platform from which King Jayawarman VII looked over his victorious returning army. The terrace was once attached to the royal palace of Firminakas right at the heart of the ancient Khmer capital city of Angkor Thom. While much of the original structure has long been rotted and collapsed, the terrace itself has survived relatively intact and the carvings along its length are quite clear. Terrace of the Elephants Highlights The northern part of the Terrace of the Elephants walls contain many especially fine sculptures, including a five-headed horse and garudas, bird-like humanoid creatures from Hindu and Buddhist mythology, as well as dancers and warriors. At the very end of the terrace, you'll get to the Terrace of the Leper King also built by the Jayavarman the second reign. The terrace of the elephants faces east, so bringing the best lighting for photography is before the noon. Interesting and photo-worthy features include the five outworks along its length, where you can see three-dimensional elephant sculptures.